who that nation, what it do. Um, got some news coming down today that I want to report on. Says another for, another former CNN producer under investigation for child sex crimes, per reports. All right, so let's get into this read right here real quick before we give our thoughts on it. The Fairfax County Police Department in Virginia confirmed to multiple sources that Rick Celebi, say Celebi, however you say it, a former producer with CNN's The Lead, hosted by Jake Tapper, is currently under investigation related to serious allegations involving potential. <laughs> Potential, potential, juvenile victim, potential, <laughs> duh, potential, y'all forgive me, potential juvenile victims, the un, <laughs> the unearthed allegations come on the heels of the arrest of another CNN producer, John Griffin, for sex crimes involving minors, so these guys are sick, bro, like, basically, we know these people are sick, man, Investigative reporting outlet Project Veritas said it believes the investigation into Celebi is tied to its reporting that uncovered graphic video and text messages from Celebi fantasizing about sex acts with a child and soliciting sexually explicit photos of underage girls. The Fairfax County Police Department confirmed to Fox News it had been in contact with with project victors and potential victims as part of as a uh, part of its investigation department the department also told fox news that police seized numerous items from celebi's virginia home quote detectives assigned to the child ex exploitation squad of the major crime bureau are leading the investigation fairfax county police said in a statement according to multiple media reports why we will eventually be transparent about our findings safe regarding the personal privacy safeguarding the personal privacy and safety of victims and witnesses as well as maintaining the integrity of our criminal investigations are of prom of paramount importance so they're saying it's very important that they maintain the integrity of the investigation the department declined to go into further details regarding potential charges or what was seized from Celebi's home. According to Fox News, Matt Dornick, CNN's head of strategic communications, told the National Desk that Celebi had resigned from his position more than two weeks ago and is no longer employed with the network. And to Matt Dornick, I say, what does that matter if, if y'all let him go? You know what I'm saying? If y'all already the bottom line is y'all worked with this cat. And y'all worked with um what's the cat's name up here? Um John. Y'all worked with John Griffin as well. I mean these people y'all gotta understand these people go to each other's house for Thanksgiving. These people are friends with each other. These people spend a lot of time with each other. So if two of them have already been caught do you what makes you think that there's not more in there in working for CNN that's doing the same things what 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 would make me have confidence in that y'all already got two people in y'all in your in your uh producers you know your office that's crazy you know what i'm saying like that's that's nuts bro so like that's why you got to understand that it doesn't matter where you work at. It doesn't matter what kind of job you got, what kind of money you got, man. These people are sick nowadays, man. And these people report on stuff, are constantly breaking news, constantly trying to get people thrown in jail, all kind of stuff. But yet they doing some nasty shit like this behind closed scenes. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the end of this story says Griffin was not fired for his conduct until after his arrest so griffin up there he didn't get arrested he didn't get fired into after his arrest bro he didn't get fired to after his arrest well now he didn't get fired after his arrest it says griffin got was not fired for his conduct until after his arrest on accusations 
of soliciting minors for sex, according to Fox News. And look at Fox News trying to put their two cents in to stump CNN out. The charges against Mr. Griffin are deeply disturbing. A CNN spokesperson reportedly told Fox News earlier this month, we learned of his his uh, arrest Friday afternoon and terminated his employment Monday. The Fairfax County Police Department did not respond to the request for comments from the national desk. All right, let's watch this little video right here, see what they're talking about. Hey, Rick, I'm a reporter with Project Veritas. What do you have to say about your recent accusations against crimes against children? Do you still work for CNN, Rick? Sir, I'm done having my mouth on here. Slowly, I'm sick, I'm sipper. Project Veritas exposed another creep at CNN. Yet another producer, Rick Salibi, at CNN, we've exposed. So he thinks, because you sent me money, you're going to get a nude photo of me and my daughter? Are you insane? He's asked for nude pictures of your 15-year-old daughter? Yep. Mom and daughter pics. He always says mom and daughter pics. Rick, do you still work for CNN? <laughs> Look at him running. Do you have any comments, sir? Yes, sir. Wow. Once again, we ask the questions and they run away. Wow. I don't know. You know, this is crazy, bro. You know what I'm saying? How this ain't even blown up bigger to what it is, bro. You know what I'm saying? And why is it there uh, a vet, uh, an investigation going on in CNN and running thorough reports and check and see what all these people are on? Because if they got two, bro, you know it's more. That's all I got to say about that. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this down in the comments. Y'all like and subscribe. And, you know, just let me know, bro, if y'all want to see me react to anything else. This is crazy. Till next time I'm out. Peace.